breaking right now at 1230. One of the entrances to Carolina Place Mall is shut down right now due to some type of hazardous material. Queen City News anchor Derek Dellinger is live from the mall right now. And Derek, uh, what can you tell us? Well, and why we can tell you right now, in fact, we can show it to you. I'm just going to get out of the way so you can actually see exactly what's going on here right now. We are still working to get details confirmed, though, from Pineville Police on what exactly this is. But this appears to be the same area where we reported narcotics exposure happened earlier this week involving an officer. We'll have more details coming up on that in just a moment. We did, however, get some uh, video just a, a few minutes ago of the uh, scene that's a little bit closer there. As far as, the, as far as the entrance closure is concerned, though, this is what we came across this afternoon. Police tape up hazardous materials bag and a note on the door at the entrance, uh, one of several in Tabelk, by the way, uh, but this is the only one that does appear to be closed. Uh, we're working right now to get more information from Pineville Police on what has been happening out here, but they have so far not gotten back to, gotten back to us. We are still waiting to hear back from them on the specifics of this. We should mention, though, uh, as we come back out here live, that we were out here for another story. We mentioned off the top at noon that there was a report of narcotics exposure by an officer who was on the job earlier this week. Uh, we were told that they were performing their duties when they came across a powdery substance and had to be administered Narcan on the scene. The big question, though, is whether or not that incident from Monday is related to what's out here right now. We are still working to get that figured out, and as soon as we have an answer, we will let you know. For now, we are live in Pineville. Derek Dellinger, Queen City News.